Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So for today's look I did this really kind of soft and really easy last minute Valentine's Day look. Just like a few purple colors and on the lid and just like a light pink glossy lip. It's the eye look is so easy like I think I only use like three colors and two brushes. The only hard part is putting on winged liner and lashes and you don't even need lashes and you don't have to do winged liner if you don't want to. So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed the last minute easy Valentine's Day look. So yeah, if you guys like this, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel to be notified whenever I post a video. Um, I will have a list of all the products mentioned in this video in the bottom bar along with a link to all my social medias in case you want to follow me anywhere. So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed it and if you want to see how I got this look, just keep on watching. So I'm starting off with the Revlon Photo Ready Airbrush Effect Foundation. Then I'm going with my Benefit Goo Proof Brow Pencil and ABH Tinted Brow Gel. Now I'm going with the NARS Dual Intens Intensity Eyeshadow in the shade Callisto. It's like a really pretty purpley color and just this Laura Mercier Dome to Brush. And I'm being really sloppy with this. I'm putting this on my lid, on my crease, everywhere. Um, and then I'm going in with this Buxom Dolly's Wild Side Palette. And I'm first picking up on this shade called spoiled sexy it's kind of like a purpley mauvey shade on a fluffy brush and just putting that through my crease lightly as a transition shade i kind of did this backwards but for this look i wanted the shimmers to kind of th show through and not be like on top then i'm going in with that same palette in the shade wild nights i'm kind of focusing this on the outer v of my eye and into the crease as well and then just blending everything out then I'm just putting on some wing liner. This is the Kai liner and some lashes. These are the 143 lashes from Ilore. Then I'm going in with concealer and this is the um, Maybelline Age Rewind in the shade Brightener. And I'm just putting this under my eyes, my chin, my nose, forehead, everywhere just to brighten. And I'm blending all that out with a damp beauty blender. Now I'm just setting everywhere that I concealed with Laura Mercier Translucent Powder and a Morphe, I believe it's an E4 brush. E49 brush, sorry. Then I'm just lining my lower waterline with L'Oreal Silk, uh, Silk Kissimmee Liner. Then I'm taking that same shimmery purple shade again and just putting that underneath my lower lash line and that same matte mauve shade under my lower lash line as well. Then I'm just going in with a L'Oreal Telescopic Carbon Black Mascara and just giving my bottom lashes a coat of mascara. And I started to go in with this bronzer from Buxom, but it like had absolutely no pigment, so it kind of looks like it does, but in person it really didn't. So I ended up switching and going in with NARS Laguna, which you see right now, and I just added some of that on top because I needed more bronzer because that bronzer just wasn't cutting it. Then I'm going in with the Makeup Forever Pro Sculpting sculpting duo in 01 and taking the highlight shade and then spritzing my brush with some MAC Fix Plus just to make it more intense. I'm just putting that on my cheekbone, tip of the nose, cupid's bow, and our corners and brow bone. You know the drill if you've been watching my videos. And then I'm just picking up on NARS Callisto again. I kind of wanted to tie in the highlight and so I'm just adding a little bit of that. And then I'm going with the Dior Addict Lipstick in 469, 65. And then also on top of this, the MAC and Mariah Carey lip gloss and Rainbow Interlude. back to my channel so for today's look I filmed this pinky rose gold smoky eye it's not a super intense smoky eye I think it's very wearable actually if you wanted to wear it every day um, and I just wanted to film another Valentine's 